something new Lots of things to see and lots of things to do In October, our thoughts naturally turn to fall foliage, pumpkins, and of course, Halloween. This episode of Experience Louisville will take you to historic Old Louisville, one of our city's greatest neighborhood gyms. There, we'll introduce you to a new fall tradition, the Old Louisville Ghost Tour, that promises to be a spooky, good time for the whole family. I think what makes Old Louisville unique is not only the, the color of the neighborhood, the people, because it's a true inner city neighborhood. And I don't think you find that in too many places. We have the largest collection of Victorian mansions in the United States with an abundance of different types of architecture. Uh, you can walk down one street and find 10 different architectural styles or blends or a combination of, which makes the neighborhood really unique. One of the many things that we do with our guests that come here to the Visitor Center is kind of guide them through a little more. Uh, but we also do give guided tours from um, the Visitor Center here. Uh, one of those is called Mansions of Milestones, which is a little bit about the architecture as well as how the community came about. But probably one of the most popular uh, tours that we have that we offer is called the Ghosts of Old Louisville. And there couldn't be a better time of year to do that. Uh, kind of a little bit of the history, a little bit of uh, uh, the eeriness, uh, and a little bit about the folks who decided to kind of linger behind. You know, in doing research on the neighborhood, I not only discovered it was the largest Victorian neighborhood, it might be the spookiest neighborhood as well. So I came up with the idea of um, putting these uh, stories together in a collection as a way of promoting the uh, history and the architecture of the, the neighborhood. And um, uh, the tour focuses on a lot of the spots that are mentioned in the book. One of the more popular spots is this, the, uh, the steps of the First Church of Christ Scientists. This is a building that was started in 1916. So legend has it that the apparition of this young woman still paces the upper steps, especially on cold fall evenings. And she's supposedly waiting for her lover who never showed up. Uh, he was a soldier that supposedly died in the Spanish influenza epidemic of 1918. Okay, another location is 1412 South 6th Street, which is known as the old Jenny Cassidy Free Infirmary for Women. Uh, this was a hospital where a lot of poor women in the neighborhood retreated. And people who live there today uh, still suspect that some of these women who might have died in childbirth or in the various uh, epidemics in the early part of the century. Uh, one of the other locations that uh, tourists on our Ghosts of a Louisville tour visit is the uh, Conrad Caldwell House. That's a home that was built in 1892 for Theophilus Conrad. He was one of the wealthiest men in the city at the time. And uh, people who go there today sort of suspect that his spirit quite uh, hasn't vacated the premises. Luckily, the, uh, the spirits seem to be benevolent, and uh, we're uh, sort of proud of that. In old Louisville, most of our spirits are very friendly spirits. For those interested, people can call the Visitor Center in Historical Louisville and make reservations. Uh, we offer narrator guided coach tours that leave every Friday from 7.30 to 9 o'clock. In the month of October, we have uh, several different tours on Friday evenings, and then we also add tours on Saturday evenings as well. They can also go online at www.ghostsofoldlouisville.com. Hi, I'm Louisville Mayor Jerry Abramson. Thanks for watching this month's edition of Experience Louisville. I'm excited you were able to visit our hauntingly beautiful Old Louisville area. It's just one of the many historic neighborhoods that make our community such a great place to live and visit. Throughout our neighborhoods, you'll find unique places to shop and amazing restaurants, many with international cuisine. As you saw with the continued expansion of our Fair and Exposition Center, there's incredible growth and energy in our community right now. So join us next month as we explore new and old ways to experience Louisville. See you then.